Getting to our number one story of the morning, it happened again. A high speed pursuit ends in a horrific crash and claims the life of an innocent bystander. KCAL News reporter Rick Montanez is live in Northridge with what he's learned in the investigation. And Amy, just in the last five minutes, we learned who the victim is. A 19-year-old college student named Eric Barbosa. He was killed right out here. His car came to a rest here. You can see some of the debris still on the grass. And his family just left those flowers here where the Honda Civic ended up after this crash. They say he was heading home from work in Granada Hills, coming here to Northridge. He's a student by day and working by night. Uh, we have uh, learned from LAPD that detectives are interviewing the suspect accused of killing 19-year-old Eric Barbosa here overnight. Police are still trying to track down a second man who ran from the scene of this deadly pursuit crash. It all happened around 1230 at Roscoe Boulevard and Lindley Avenue. There were two mangled cars at the scene, the suspect's black SUV and Barbosa's green Honda Civic. Police say the suspect T-boned Barbosa, killing him here at the scene. Moments before before that, though, police spotted the black SUV at Roscoe and White Oak, a half mile from here. They say the SUV and driver were wanted for an armed robbery from yesterday. When he didn't stop, they started the pursuit, and it wasn't long before the deadly crash. That's when the driver and passenger from the black SUV took off running. As I said, police arrested the driver, and this, of course, brings up the question of public safety during pursuits. LAPD says it's a judgment call based on what officers know at the time. There is a balance test when it comes to pursuits. Um, in this case, this person on the vehicle was identified um, as armed and dangerous. Sadly, these things these things happen and it could have been worse. You never know if the cops never intervened. You never know what that person could have done. Um, sadly, someone did lose their life, but um, maybe there's different precautions that they can take. Police also tell us they found a loaded rifle in the suspect's SUV. That suspect has not been identified, but again, we just learned within a few minutes that the victim is 19-year-old Eric Barbosa, a student at Cal State Northridge. He was living here with his aunt, his parents living in Arizona still, and his aunt says she's angry that this happened, angry that it's the result of a police pursuit. We'll hear more from her throughout the day here on KCAL News. For now, reporting live in Northridge, I'm Rick Montanez, KCAL News. Ugh. KCAL 9 is now KCAL News. CBS News Los Angeles, your local news, streaming wherever, whenever. Got your phone handy? Of course you do. Scan this right here. Download the CBS LA app. And just like that, you're connected to all the best local news and videos. Now, if only everything were this easy.